what it's like to have a young mind in your hands, to spin an imagination, to weave dreams, and shape how a six-year-old sees the world. When, when I, I learned how to read, read, my dreams became vivid. Mind filled with skylines of the now possible, this little light of mine became tangible, and all I could see is who I could be. Every sentence turned into an adventure, and I fell in love with each story that celebrated me and my creativity. A girl with curly hair that danced through the hallways and up into the clouds. A boy that told stories with his hands and stick figures and ate all the bagels he could every chance he got. When we, we learned, learned how, how to read, read, we remembered that the world was our oyster and that we were pearls. Miss Frizzle showed me the ocean depth and the magic school bus took us there. When I watched children jump into the deep end of six feet, their smiles and laughter caused a tidal wave. When we became teachers, we became life vests, holding the next generation just above the water so they could see their horizons. When a student learns how to write their name for the first time, they do magic. Each letter spirals into a spell and they become wizards and witches. Astronauts and adventurers on a voyage to create themselves. Musicians and mavericks. Ballerinas and ball players. That grew to their own tunes. Boys and girls. Students and stars. Who have been given the power to record their visions. So, so they, they can see, see themselves the way we see them. Limitless. Limitless.